morning and welcome to this edition of News Leader on 6. I'm Jenny English. And I'm Jim Fuller. In tonight's news, we'll tell you how to make sure your Christmas tree is safe. The Tullahoma School Board held a public forum this week to get input about hiring a new director of schools. We'll bring you video from the Manchester Christmas Parade and John Gray will talk with the THS Choral Director about the upcoming Breakfast with Santa event. We'll have these stories and more on tonight's News Leader on 6. Your word is like a lamp into my feet and a light into my path as we celebrate the birth of Jesus Christ. Follow his path of love, forgiveness, obedience, and prayer. To all of you we wish... Merry Christmas! Keith Barnett here at Russell Barnett Kia in Tullahoma. Only two remaining 2018 Kia Stingers, up to $10,000 off original MSRP. That's Russell Barnett Kia in Tullahoma, home of the lifetime firetrain warranty. And remember, my question is, why buy anywhere else? <laughs> The spirit of the season is timeless. From our family to yours, happy holidays. Welcome back. Christmas trees are among the cornerstones of holiday celebrations. They're lovely reminders of childhood, family traditions, and natural beauty. But a Christmas tree can also be among the deadliest of household fire hazards when they aren't properly maintained or when they're kept near heat sources. While fire departments only respond to an average of 200 Christmas tree fires per year, according to the National Fire Protection, Protection Association, those fires are far more deadly than other home fires. NFPA data shows that one of every 30 32 reported home fires caused by Christmas trees resu resulted in a death. This compares to one in one, one death per 143 reported home fires resulting from other causes. To help Tennesseans reduce their risk of Christmas tree fires, the Tennessee State Fire Marshal's Office shares the following tips for consumers when selecting, decorating, and maintaining Christmas trees. If you choose an artificial tree, make sure it's labeled and certified by the manufacturer as fire retardant. If you choose a live tree, select one with fresh green needles that do not fall off when touched. A good test of a tree's age is bouncing the tree trunk on the ground. If needles fall off, the tree has been cut too long, has dried out, and could be a fire hazard. Before placing a live tree, cut two inches from the base of the trunk. Make sure any tree is displayed at least three feet away from any heat source. Fireplaces, radiators, candles, and even heat vents can cause a live tree to dry out, causing it to be more easily ignited by heat, flames, or sparks. When using a live tree, do not leave it up longer than two weeks and water it daily. Never use lit candles to decorate a tree and always turn off decorative lights before leaving home or going to bed. The Tullahoma School Board held a meeting at Tullahoma High School Tuesday night to hear input from the public regarding the qualifications they would expect from the new director of Tullahoma City Schools. Tennessee School Board's Associate Executive Director Tammy Grissom spoke to the group about how the search process would be conducted and asked the group their opinion about the positive characteristics of the school district. On behalf of the Tullahoma City Board of Education, Thank you so much for taking the time to come out tonight. My name is Tammy Grissom and this is Jenna Swan. We are with the Tennessee School Boards Association. We are a nonprofit private organization that represents all the school boards in the state and we provide a variety of services, one of those being a superintendent search uh, service. So the Tullahoma Board has asked us to assist them in finding uh, you all a new director of schools or superintendent of schools, uh, same thing, um, for them. Just before we get started, um, tonight is strictly a meeting to hear your input. I'll ask you a few questions. At the end, we've got a survey we'd like for you to fill out. It's just personal characteristics we'd like you to rate what you'd like to see in a new director of schools. Uh, we, we don't need to know your name or any of that. We just, uh, Jenna will just type down the comments that you make about the questions. Uh, once we get all the comments, we will compile a report 
and present to the board on December the 10th and we'll come up with some proposed criteria for a new superintendent school based on the comments that you make tonight. I know that the uh, district has also sent out a survey to all the employees so we have that information as well that I've already read and we'll have that in the interim report that I'll present to the board on December the 10th. At that meeting the board will uh, adopt the criteria. They'll make any edits that they'd like to make to what I propose and then we'll do a brochure um, announcing the the vacancy it'll tell a little bit about the community um, it'll have the criteria and about the district we'll send that out, out on December 10th and then we will have um, a period of, of where folks can submit their application to our office and we have an online system and the deadline will be sometime in the middle of January for any person interested in applying for the job uh, they'll submit their credentials to, to our office. Then our office will take all applicants and review their resume and their supporting documents and then we will have a screening committee that will come in and select up to five finalists that best meet the criteria that the board's adopted. And then on February the 11th, <coughs> we will uh, present the finalists to the board and then sometime following that they've not determined the interview dates yet <coughs> excuse me but they will um, set aside dates to interview uh, each of the candidates it's a nationwide search so anyone can apply uh, once the board adopts the criteria and whatever they have is the minimum qualifications you obviously if you don't have the minimum qualifications then you won't be considered through our search committee but that'll all be in the brochure that uh, we'll send out will have the minimum qualifications plus the criteria. So it's a nationwide search. Okay, well we're going to get started with the first question. What are the good things going on in Tullahoma City Schools that you would like to see continued? When you have someone new coming in, you know, sometimes it brings about change, but what are the programs, services, anything positive? What are the positive things that you'd like to see continued? I feel like the school system as a whole has a very positive approach towards teaching the whole child. You know, we, okay. we have excellence in academic areas, and that's balanced with a very a, a strong, comprehensive athletics program. That's balanced with a very strong arts program. Uh, I would certainly love to see that. So do a good job uh, teaching the whole child, good athletics, good academics, good arts, just a well-rounded uh, program. Okay, good. Oh, I think schools are very important to people, not just parents, but people like me. Right. Like the past. Good. Good community support. Yes, and to piggyback on that, this is a community where it's the perfect balance of, of great parenting, great community, great school, that like everyone's here to do the best for the kids. Okay. And that's not common yeah, elsewhere. Good. Being able to maintain those relationships is exceeding. Maintain relationships within the, not just within the school itself, mm -hmm. but the community at large. Okay. So you got good parental involvement, good community involvement, more more so like a family oriented system, right? Stay with us. More news later is coming up after these messages. Keith Barnett here at Russell Barnett Kia in Tullahoma. Check out the 2019 fully loaded V6 Kia Sorento up to $6,400 off original MSRP. That's Russell Barnett Kia in Tullahoma, home of the lifetime powertrain warranty. And remember, why buy anywhere else? When your family suffers the loss of a loved one, the caring and compassionate staff at Tullahoma Funeral Home and Coffee County Funeral Chapel are standing by to assist you in every way possible. We are proud to support local industry and offer only Batesville caskets. Many funeral homes don't own or operate a crematory. We utilize the only crematory in Coffee County. Your loved one never leaves Coffee County. We can accommodate any need and any budget. Consider our complete pre-need service to remove this burden from your family during their time of grief. Lock in today's low costs and protect from inflation. Tullahoma Funeral Home and Coffee County Funeral Chapel. Our family caring for your family. Is this the year you want to get fit? If so, check out just some of the things Tullahoma Parks and Rec has to offer. Kickboxing, aerobics, silver sneakers workouts, swim lessons, boot camp, 
water aerobics, basketball, Zumba, yoga, pickleball, lap swimming, treadmill, karate. Get fit Tullahoma and have some fun with Tullahoma Parks and Rec. Welcome back. Now we bring you more video from the Manchester Christmas Parade, which was held last Sunday night, featuring the float winners. All right, here comes one of our parade winners. It's for the Eastern Star. They are the first place winner for the large float. Oh, that's a hit Very nice. Thank you all. Merry Christmas. Here we go with ice skaters. That's me. Being out of fireworks so much. They're here for the holiday. They're here for the holiday. So it's all good. I'm going to get a quick break. I'm going to get a quick break right now. I'll just pick a point. Take a point. Take a point. Take a point. Take Right behind them, Sofro and Coffee Franklin in Warren County's Melbourne are the winner as well for the regular flute and they've been second place winner in the regular flute of the this is our first place regular card there. And we bring his pets and bookkeeping. Very nice. So the whole That's some snow sitting up here. Snow coming out. We are through here. That takes a lot of work. You know, the boys have like that. We try something like that all the time. Very small, and we can go out of the garage. That makes party animals. Look at here, it's the one of our party animals. That makes. Oh, look, they got it. They got a llama down there. Yeah. Those llamas? Those are all packers, all right? An alpaca, sorry, no offense. <laughs> this, this is a third place large float, you know? What are we doing? CCCHS Billions. All right! They're here to me! This looks like another winner here. Yeah, this is third place regular float, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's going to be Shelton's Shelton Buy Sell Trade Livestock. All right. They are the third place regular float winner. This is Snowman on the end. And a chicken and a pig. All right, who you got here, Matthew? This should be British Chef Home Health. British Chef Home Health. All right. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. I think he's got the heat on him. Yeah. Very nice play for the British Chef Home Health. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And up next, the Tullahoma Fire Department. That's cool fire truck right there. That goes to the fire dog. Very nice. 
That's the city of Manchester Flint right there, they have to So when you have a lot of more, when you have several Elvises, that's uh -huh. Elvi. Is that what they've ever seen? Elvis Johnson's with Elvi. More news is coming up in a moment. It's not invoice. It's not MSRP. It's not Christmas Day, although it may feel like it. It's the lowest prices in Middle Tennessee, period. It's a Stan McNabb Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram or Stan McNabb Chevrolet Buick GMC Cadillac before these prices are gone forever. All right, the cat's out of the bag at Carroll Street Liquor in Tullahoma. Now you know where to go if you're planning a get-together and want the ideal wine or spirit. Party planning can be stressful, but at Carroll Street Liquor, you'll find everything you need. Mixers, gift sets, and all of your favorite spirit brands. So if you're feeling the pressure to pull off the ideal party, come to Carroll Street Liquor and select among the seemingly endless supply of wines, spirits, gift sets, and more. Your perfect party, it's in the bag with Carroll Street Liquors. What's a Tennessee vacation? It starts off like any road trip. And then, boom. Adventure and thrills everywhere you look, which happens to be some of the most beautiful scenery in the country. Music here, history there, and all kinds of green in between. Come relax and unwind, or bring the crowd for some stargazing, or stargazing. Whatever you do, come hungry and expect an awesome soundtrack. It's all right here in Tennessee. We're playing your song. For a free vacation guide, visit tnvacation.com. Welcome back. The 6th Annual Young Artist Showcase was held recently at South Jackson Civic Center. The program featured some of the most talented young artists in the community who are recommended for the program by their instructors. We're pleased to bring you this video of Jacob Howell, a student of Doug Clark, as he performs Carnival of Venice by Herbert L. Clark. <laughs>
We'll be right back with more news later after this. The wait is finally over. The all-new redesigned Ford Ranger is back at Russell Barnett Ford of Tullahoma. Stop and test drive one today at Russell Barnett Ford of Tullahoma on Highway 55, home of the lifetime powertrain warranty. And remember, my question is, why buy? anywhere else. Here at Manchester Funeral Home, we know the importance of living and working in our local community because it's those families who we serve during their time of need honorably. We believe in supporting local business and offer only 100% Batesville caskets, the best in the industry and a driver of our local economy. If you want straightforward and fair pricing while working with the people you know, choose Manchester Funeral Home, serving your community since 1932. And pre-planning and pre-funding can be the best gift you ever leave your loved ones. Call us to pre-arrange. Manchester Funeral Home. Our family, caring for your family since 1932. So you've been meaning to do something healthy, commune with nature, get outdoors and meet new people. We have the perfect solution. Come hike with us. You can find a Tennessee Trails Association chapter near you, including Clarksville, Columbia Franklin, Highland Rim, Jackson, Knoxville, Oak Ridge, Memphis, Murfreesboro, Nashville, Plateau at Crossville, and Upper Cumberland. We're on the web at TennesseeTrails.org. It's fun, it's stress-free, and it's good for you. See you on the trails. Welcome back. John Gray spoke with Tullahoma High School Choral Director Gary Wilson about the Breakfast with Santa program coming to First United Methodist Church in Tullahoma. Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm John Gray reporting from somewhere close to the North Pole and I'm very excited today to have a gentleman with me, Dr. Gary Wilson. And Gary is involved in his first year of being in charge of the music programs at Tullahoma High School. And you are getting ready to dive right into the middle of your first <laughs> Breakfast with Santa. That is correct. And it is, uh, I'm, I've been so fortunate that I have a wonderful parent organization and great students who are helping me understand all of this and teaching me what I'm supposed to do. Well, you know, I, as, as we were discussing, as we were coming up the snow-covered path, yes, sir. headed toward Christmas Village, uh, right. that uh, my son was involved in, in the, the Aristocats years ago, and that program has been an ongoing program, and the Breakfast with Santa has been a wonderful fundraiser throughout the years that that group has used to support their trips to go to different programs and, right. and perform in different places. Uh, and you're, how are you finding everything in, in Tullahoma as your adventure is <laughs> you've set down on the path uh, to Aristocat land in Tullahoma? That's right. Well, I, I'm enjoying it tremendously. And, and one of the greatest things that I have found out here is the long tradition. There are so many people still in this area who were involved in the Aristocats. They had children who were in the Aristocats. And it's a great tradition for me to walk into. I'm, I'm loving that part of it. So Breakfast with Santa, this is actually the 38th year. <laughs> for this. Yes it is. Yes it is. And and that is going to be uh, this Saturday, right? It is this Saturday, the 7th. Uh, we have s tickets available for the early seating at 8 a.m. Mm -hmm. and for the last seating at 11 a.m. Most of the seats for the 930 performance are already gone, but I can check. But right, there are definitely right. seats and, and for that, 8 again, and 11. Is, is that still at the Methodist Church? Is it First United Methodist Church? We're so grateful that they allow us to use their space for this. And, and we want you folks to realize that this is the same as always. The decorations are always outstanding. Uh, that, that are in that transform that gymnasium <laughs> and meeting hall into Breakfast with Santa. There's always great food. And, and Santa Claus, a representative of, from the North Pole, That's right. will actually be in the back room back there uh, meeting with children yes, sir. to find out uh, you know, exactly what they might need for Christmas. Right, because they, they have to tell him what they want. That's right, and I think there might even be some photo ops back there. That is correct. There will be a photographer on site 
eager to take pictures with Santa Claus. All right. Well, Gary, thank you for coming and being with us today, and welcome to Telehoma. My pleasure. And thank you I so hope much you for enjoy. inviting me. We'll be over there to see you, I'm sure, on Saturday. Great. And you enjoy your first breakfast with Santa. Thank you. And I'm we excited hope about it. We hope you'll be here for many more. Thank you very much. We'll be right back with your weather forecast. Mustang Sally, you better slow that Mustang down at Russell Barnett Ford and Tullahoma on Highway 55, where you can receive up to $4,000 off original MSRP. That's Russell Barnett Ford and Tullahoma, and remember, my question is, why buy anywhere else? We're losing it, doctor. Not on my shift, quickly, brush. Roller. What a transformation. It's gonna be okay. Okay, nothing. At Paintworks of Tullahoma, we specialize in domestic emergencies with Martin Senior Paints. You can be the paint doctor, too, when you treat your home with Martin Senior interior and exterior finishes. Doctor, we've got another one. Got you covered. Paintworks of Tullahoma. Come see the paint doctor, Stat. Welcome back. We're going to take a look at our weather forecast right now, starting with our weather history on this day. Our record high on this day is 74 degrees and our record low is 5 degrees. Our average high is 52 degrees and the average low is 33. For tonight, expect partly cloudy weather with a low of 44. On Sunday, look for cloudy weather with a high of 54 and a low of 48. Some rain is in the forecast again on Monday with a high of 61 and a low of 50. And rain again on Tuesday with a high of 52 and a low of 28. And that's it for this edition of News Leader on 6. And don't forget to join us each Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday at 6, 8, and 10 for News Leader on the 6. You have a good day.